Hi everyone, this is Jopke. I would like to uh, show you and tell you about the Christmas gift game because um, we're doing a video a little while ago of making these uh, cards. Uh, I got some questions about um, what this game is all about. Uh, I thought everyone would know about that, but apparently uh, um, not everybody knows this game. So I really want to tell you about this because it is so much fun playing this with friends or family during the hol uh, holidays, the Christmas season. Uh, this year we do it with, we play this game with our friends, Annette and Will. Uh, but also with uh, our son and his girlfriend, Avi, and we play it with Christmas and with uh, Old and New Year's Day. So, um, this one is a personalized game that I made myself and I bought this little box at Action and this is Christmas gift game in Dutch, homemade by Jopke, which is me, and these are kind of the rules and you can um, make them up as you want because there are really no rules but you can um, make them yourself but um, you need a dice and there are three rounds really and the first round you just throw the dice and if you um, have a one it says just uh, roll, roll it again. If it says two then you need to give this to your uh, right neighbor. Um, if it says three it says uh, take a gift from the table but don't unwrap it yet. So uh, the ascension is that if you play it with four, six or eight people, it doesn't matter, you all buy a few presents and you make sure they are not too expensive, they, they can be fun presents, crazy presents or fake presents even. You can do whatever you want and you all uh, buy a few of them and uh, the rule between our friends and and my son and his girlfriend is that you that we buy five uh, presents uh, per person and they can be very cheap and they go on one big stack on the on the table and then if you uh, uh, roll the dice at at three it says take a gift from the, the stack but don't unwrap it yet. Um, if you uh, roll the dice and get a four it says give the dice to the second neighbor on your left. If you have five it says if you have already a present uh, put it back on the stack and if you have six then you can uh, get a present from the table or the stack but don't unwrap it yet. So that is round one and you can set a timer on this and play it for about 15 minutes or 20 minutes uh, depending on how many people you are playing this with. And if that is done we go to round two and ra round two um, it's again you roll the dice and um, if you uh, have one you can roll the dice again. If you have two you give the dice to your right neighbor. If you have three you can um, pick a present from the stack uh, or you can get to unwrap a present that you already have with you. Um, if you have four then you need to give the dice to the second neighbor on your left. If you have five 
you need to put back a present on the stack and six you can unwrap a present again and also with this uh, you can play this until all the presents are unwrapped and um, or you set a timer and the third round uh, is well we play it like this is we um, put the dice away so it goes away and we pick we pick all these cards that I made can you see these are about 92 cards that I made all did some stickers some painting some doodling some stickers uh, whatever and uh, they all have assignments I just pick a few they all have an assignment so this says choose two persons not you who will have to switch place for example and this card says the the person that is the smallest needs to give a gift to the person which is the tallest um, this one says change place with the one who has the least amount of presents um, this one says you can take one present from your neighbor on the left and one present from the neighbor on your right and this one says give a present to the neighbor on your right uh, which has the letter O in it and if you don't have a present with a letter O then uh, you are lucky and you don't have to do anything so you can go on and on and uh, come up with all kinds of assignments uh, there are um, uh, quite a few here sometimes I have doubled them because it is very difficult to think about 92 um, assignments but uh, this is how the game is uh, goes so for round three you just make a stack of the cards and everybody takes a card uh, in turns and will have to do what's on this uh, uh, card uh, there are also because you can set a timer for this as well because this game could go on and on and on and on there are a few funny ones let me see if I can Uh, this is um, a card if if you go into the last round round three and you have set the timer this is a card which says you can take one present from your stack or the stack uh, on the table and you can take that present home with you it's yours so this is to uh, sure that a present is yours and there's also this is another I have a couple of these in the game okay a black card and this one says until somebody or you uh, roll uh, the dice and get a six you are uh, 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 you are non-active <laughs> how do you say it you can't play for a little while until somebody or you throws a six so until that time you need to wait and there's also uh, a funny one uh, with oven mittens uh, so you can get to unwrap 
presents as much as you can but you have to uh, wear oven mittens uh, and until somebody throws a six and then you your turn uh, is over so sometimes you can make very funny um, uh, assignments sorry I'm looking for one that is a bonus card where is the bonus card here a joker um, this card if you if you pull this card you can keep it with you and until someone wants to take away a present from you you can give him the card and then uh, he can take that present so that's how you play this game and I can tell you we always have a lot a lot of fun uh, playing this game we do this for about well I'm thinking it must be 15 years or so that we play this game and we have so much fun every year um, sometimes often our friends buy a lottery ticket and so the ticket is in the game and we are really fighting for it so just showing you a few of the cards that I created very simple very um, 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 how do you say it I try to do it in the style of cat hand and I'm not even close I know but I did a lot with uh, images and doodling and black and white and some stripes and dots and uh, that kind of thing so I had to make uh, so much of them and I really love her style so I thought that could be nice to uh, to do so there you go so this is the Christmas gift game you can all uh, you can do with of course with birth birthdays or whenever and um, well, I hope um, you will play it too this year. So this was me showing you the rules and how I created this game. And I hope you will play it and have lots of fun. Bye!